now let us discuss about the drainage system of india in india how many types of rivers are there broadly basing on the land form which is existing in our indian context we can divide the entire rivers into two major rivers one is the himalayan river the other one is the peninsular rivers the himalayan rivers are the rivers which have their origination or the source from the himalayas so that is the reason why appropriately they are known as himalayan rivers so in the himalayan rivers these rivers flow continuously whole along the year even in the summer and in the winter and in the rainy season they flow and they maintain the equal balance of amount of water in their sources so they continue with a huge amount of water in their journey so these are known as perennial rivers their sources as i mentioned earlier they have from himalayas the melted snow and also from rainfall in their process of uh, journey or in the course of their journey they make many meanders and the oxbow lakes and the famous himalayan rivers are indus ganga and brahmaputra so the himalayan rivers originate in the himalayan region and they flow through continuously whole along the year and they have water completely filled in them whole along the year they never dry up like they do not have any seasonal impact on them and they make many meanders and the oxbows and here indus ganga and brahmaputra are the important himalayan rivers of india moving on to the next broad category of the rivers that is the peninsular rivers the peninsular rivers are the rivers which are originating in the western ghats these are found in the peninsular plateau region and these are non perennial like the himalayas they get their source from the western ghat hills and the mountain ranges and they have the impact of the seasons in summer most of the time the level of the water will be less when compared to the rainy season and the winter season and their sources are from the western ghats and the rainfall region and they do form deep valleys in contrast to the himalayan rivers and the important rivers of the peninsular plateau are godavari krishna kaveri mahanandi all these are the important rivers and these all originate in the western ghats flow towards the east and fall into the bay of bengal so these are the two major broad divisions of the river system of india the himalayan rivers and the peninsular rivers if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbse syllabus